Hey, what's going on, guys? It is Gooseman, and I'm coming back at you with a video. And before I get started, if you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe, ring the bell, and click all notifications. All right, and uh, give the video a thumbs up. It helps the channel out. It helps the video out, too, when you do that. So LSU plays Auburn this coming Saturday night in Baton Rouge, and I will be live for that game. That's a late game. That's an 8 o'clock central kick late start coming Saturday night uh, in Death Valley. So LSU and Auburn, LSU Auburn coming to play this Saturday, like I said, and LSU has won three in a row after losing to UCLA, albeit uh, we played you know, three lesser teams, uh, you know, McNeese State, <laughs> um, Central Michigan, and then last week we played Mississippi State. Mississippi State's a lower end. SEC school, but LSU did get win the get the win on the road on that one. Auburn had a tough game last week against Georgia State. Uh, they had to come back and win that game, and late in that game. So, um, look, this game's in Baton Rouge. They haven't beaten us in Baton Rouge since 1999, and yours truly was at that game way back in 1999 uh, when Auburn did beat LSU. It's a long time ago since they. It's surprisingly, surprisingly, we play each other every other year. Uh, you know, in Baton Rouge and. Of course, we play in Auburn every, every other year. So uh, it's just weird that uh, that they have not beaten us in Baton Rouge since 1999. Now, they've had some chances throughout the years. Uh, you know, 2005, 2005 and 2007 come to mind. And then uh, 2000, and that was 2017. Yeah, 2017, they had a big lead on us. And, uh, and LSU come back and won that football game. But... Uh, Look, this game, this game is going to boil down to a few, a few things. If LSU, if LSU does these few things very, very well, uh, they're going to win this football game. One, they're going to have to run the football. LSU has to run the football, and they're going to have to run it for more like 100, 120, between 140 yards um, as a team. Uh, they can't run the ball 50 for 50 yards like they did last week against Mississippi State, uh, like they have been doing uh, throughout the year. Uh, they, they just, it's just, they, LSU is going to have to run the football. If they don't run the football, if they run the football for 50 yards this coming Saturday, they're probably more likely going to lose this football game. Uh, it's just, uh, uh, when you, when you get to the SEC, meet of the SEC play, especially when you're playing teams like Auburn, uh, you got to run the football. Number two is they are going to have to talk, stop Tank Bigsby. Tank Bigsby is a good running back for Auburn. And uh, we can't let him run wild. We can't let him get like 150 yards on the ground. Uh, if, he, if Auburn does that, if Auburn, if Auburn can run the football and they can stop our running game, uh, they, there's a good chance Auburn's going to walk out with a victory. Um, uh, just, uh, I mean, just, just, uh, I don't know. I'm just, uh, just really, really, I'm not really concerned. I'm really curious to see how that LSU comes out in this football game because we haven't been able to run the football on a consistent basis. We've had a few runs where, you know, we block well, we get 15 yards, and then and then we just, and then after that, it's just, it, it, then we get bottled up. So I think Max Johnson will pull out, if, if, they, if they can give Max Johnson time to throw the football, uh, we, we should be able to throw the football against Auburn. And our defensive line, I know they didn't show it last week, last week against Mississippi State, just because it was the game plan, but LSU's uh, LSU, you know, they they're one of the leaders in sacks uh, in the nation in SEC play. Um, so uh, we can get to the passer. I know we lost Andre Anthony a few games ago, but uh, we still have a bunch of players on our team that can get to the quarterback and affect the quarterback. So uh, that's what I'm expecting this Saturday night. Saturday night, I think LSU's uh, defense is going to come into play. Because they remember, they remember last last year when we got beat what forty eight to eleven in Auburn. So we got when we this another game that another game that uh, we need. I wouldn't call it revenge, but we're trying to be. But we lost the season before, like we lost to Mississippi, Mississippi State back in twenty twenty, and we won last week against them. So this is another another game that we're going to play a team which we lost to last year. Uh, we should be voted, should be well well motivated. It's a night game. Uh, should be should be a good crowd in Baton Rouge since it's gonna be a conference game. So um I'm just curious to see if LSU can run the football. I think we need to run the freshman more. 
Corey Kiner, Amari Goodwin, uh, Ty Davis Price. I just don't think he's an every down back. Uh, oh, I don't think. Uh, I think he should come in. And look, I, I'm not a coach. What do I know? But I think he's he'd be better suited coming in on like on third downs, stuff like that. Because I still think Ty Davis Price has a has a he he, he has a spot on this football team. Uh, I still think he does. I just don't think it's being the uh, starting running back. I think the freshmen are better and have more upside than him. But uh, they're just going to have to play to prove that point. So Tigers and Tigers. We all got, I got Tigers by, the LSU Tigers by seven. I'm going to say, I'm going to say 27 to, 27 to 20. That's going to be my final score as the LSU Tigers are going to beat the Auburn Tigers. So I'll see you guys next time, and go Tigers!